guys, in case you're new to this channel, my name is Hamad Benesha. I'm the founder of undoit.ca. In this channel, I talk about MacBooks, MacBooks repairs, everything to do with MacBooks. I'm located in Toronto, Canada, downtown next to the Sin Tower. And I have been in the business for over 20 years. I'm also an Apple certified technician and I only fix MacBooks, nothing else. So if you haven't done it yet, please don't forget to subscribe. Thank you. Well, hi guys, Hamad Benesha here for undoit.ca. Today we're working on a MacBook Pro model a1278 if you if you're not sure what your model is just look underneath the macbook it's always written there uh, macbook a1278 the this machine working perfectly fine all you need just a, a new battery as you can see here it says no charging and when you click on the power over here it says replace now okay so this procedure is the same if you have a macbook pro 13 inch model a1278 whether it's from 2009 2010 2011 2012 uh, before, before before we proceed i just want to mention i have a video about uh, macbook liquid damage and what to do what not to do i highly highly recommend you watch this video just for the future just in case you spill liquid on it and you could save you a lot of money uh, if you click on the arrow there at the top you can uh, watch it now or you can come back and watch it later but i highly highly recommend you watch that video okay so let's go ahead and um, remove uh, this battery and put a new one in Okay, so I'm just gonna go ahead and remove the screws. Okay, so the first thing when you remove the back cover, you always want to unplug the battery, even though this one is dead, but always going to have it remove the battery first, okay? Just in case you drop something on here, and if the battery is working, you could, you could damage the board, okay? So to remove this battery is fairly straightforward, it's very easy, there's nothing to it. It's one screw here, one screw here. The, most of the, screw, uh, the, the new batteries come with the, the screwdriver already because it's a special screwdriver. It's a triangle, as you can see. Okay, so there's one larger than the other. Okay, so this, the large one goes here, the short one goes here. So you pull on the battery like that. Okay, and that's it. To put a new one, you just slide it in. Okay, so I'm gonna throw this out. I'm gonna grab a new one. Okay, I got a brand new one here. Okay, brand new. Okay, just need to take it out. Okay, as I mentioned, we just slide it in like that. Okay, that's it. And then you put back the the two screws one goes here one goes there okay so then you plug it in put the back cover back even, even if it's only two screws, just to test it. Just gonna remove also the plastic here. Okay. So I'm just gonna put two screws for now until I test it. Okay, I'm gonna tune it back on and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm back and uh, as you can see, the battery is now charging 47%. Also, when you click here on the power, con condition normal, cycle con one, this means it's a brand new battery. And full charge capacity is 6200. So this is how you replace a, a battery on a MacBook Pro and model A1278. Please give me a thumbs up if you like this video. Don't forget to subscribe if, if you haven't done so. And uh, if you are located in anywhere in Canada and you have a problem with the MacBook, just uh, watch the um, instruction coming up on how to send your MacBook to, for repair, fairly easy and uh, I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thank you for watching.
The process is very easy whether you're located in Toronto or anywhere in Canada, just visit andoit.ca, click here to get a quote, or you can also click on the menu here, get a free quote, it's the same link. There is nine different categories, so try to select the one that best applies to you. In this example, I'm just going to click on my screen is black, and uh, let's assume my screen goes black when I tilt it. So I can, you can either get a free quote online, or you can also call if you prefer. Uh, for this example, I'm just going to click on get a free quote, fill up the form, and just click on submit form. When you click on submit form, this is what I receive on my hand. And as you can see, we do receive a lot of requests. Uh, actually, 90% of our business is uh, shipped to us now from all over Canada. So you can rest assured that we know what we're doing. Uh, so I read it, I analyze it, and then I send uh, an email with a quote uh, with all the options to the client. And if you decide to ship it, you just click uh, here to select your shipping option, and then you'll receive a shipping label. As soon as your MacBook is fixed, you will receive an email with pictures showing your MacBook repaired, your invoice, and how to proceed with the payment by credit card. As soon as the payment is made, we'll send it back to you. Thanks again for watching, and I look forward to receiving your MacBook. If you like this video, click the thumbs up button below to let me know, share it, and don't forget to subscribe. See you in my next video.